This is doorbell cam video from next door. It's from just before 11 o'clock last night. Obviously pandemonium as people are running from the scene. All bad, all quickly over a party, over a get together. What wrong real quick. This woman who was outside the home at the time did not want her name used. She says she saw dozens of people beginning to pack into the home just before the shooting. And I just seen the commotion, all the people coming, coming, coming. I had actually stopped some officers down the street and asked them if they can come shut it down. She says the officers were on a call so they could not come immediately, so she began heading back to the house. I heard a bang, but I don't know if it was a gunshot, but I heard a bang. And then I was sitting right down the street and then they started running out and it was just, it just all happened so quick. Chaos ensued. When she got to the home, she walked through the front door. So. Just laying on his back. Police later confirmed it was 21-year-old John Samuel McDaniel Foster III. Police provided this picture. His Facebook page shows that he works for a local construction company. Police say the other shooting victim, a 16-year-old boy, was given a ride by a private car to Cincinnati Children's where he was in stable condition as of last night. UC put out an alert last night to its students to shelter in place. It happened so much. Um... Honestly, like for me at least, I've just grown a little bit numb to it. We're just so used to getting that text. It's definitely a little disheartening because it's right next door, but I don't know. Next door neighbor Carter Colasar says the Airbnb next door has parties every now and then. It rents for about $200 a night and clearly states no parties. There clearly was a party that for some turned into a nightmare. It's going to haunt me a, a, a long time. From breaking news to feel-good stories, Local 12 has it all. Tab subscribe and click the links for more content like this.